Jackson and a host of others. So I'll tell you what, let's do. Right now, then, let's move on to the ring in our first match. Tommy Wildfire Rich going up against the Super Destroyer. And uh, you see them in the ring at this time. Tommy Rich getting set to uh, remove uh, his jacket and the Super Destroyer has removed his uh, tunic and they're ready to uh, have at it here. One fall, 10 minute time limit in this uh, first match here today on Championship Wrestling. Up into a top wrist lock at the very onset of the match. Referee Nick Patrick and so it is uh, the Super Destroyer able to uh, utilize that one to his own advantage and now wildfire ducked under for the takedown interesting crowd here today from all over the united states and we have some uh, good folks from uh, st thomas and the virgin islands visiting with us folks from ohio from west virginia uh, of course, a lot of folks from right here in Georgia as well, but interesting to have so many uh, good friends from all over the country here uh, in Atlanta at Super 17. All right, once again. Super Destroyer pressing his advantage on that one now over Tommy Wildfire Rich. About a moose clock, and it was uh, Wildfire Rich. Reversing that to a top wrist clock. Bear in mind, this match, one fall with a 10-minute uh, time limit. Come on, Tommy, let's go! <laughs> Drop to a hole by the uh, Super Destroyer. Well executed, but could not uh, take advantage of it as uh, Tommy Rich slipped away from that. Collar and elbow into a side headlock by the Super Destroyer. You know, a hip lock takedown back to the canvas. And it's Super Destroyer with the advantage position. Referee Nick Patrick was down there very quickly, caught the two shoulders down momentarily. Wildfire, however, turning to his man, has that right shoulder off the mat. He's in a predicament that uh, would be difficult for the Super Destroyer to score a pinfall from that particular combination. Back to their feet. Rich in the red trunks, the Super Destroyer, of course. Notice the way the Super Destroyer has that side headlock under the cheekbone and uh, drops him with a shoulder smash up and over his man. Reversal that time by the Super Destroyer, Tommy Wildfire. Rich breaks it up. Once again, back to a solid takedown by Tommy Wildfire Rich. see him uh, watching this match. Of course, uh, there's immediate cause for Sawyer making some comments, uh, obviously about Tommy Wildfire Rich, and it is uh, Sawyer scouting things and moving around. Up against the ring ropes now. Super Destroyer now turns uh, Let's go, Tommy. Let's go. And into the turnbuckles. Tommy Wildfire Rich may be having troubles here as a Super Destroyer. Continues to move on his man. Buzz Sawyer still outside, hurling comments back and forth. That time, Rich is in trouble. Rich, 
and a high arch backdrop. Had to be about eight feet in the air when he came down, and it is uh, stunned Rich and uh, the superstar very quickly, taking advantage of it. Uh, it appears with a uh, front face lock or possible front chancery. Lateral press. And, uh, well, possible trouble beginning to brew here, as I see now. There you see Stan Hansen and Buzz Sawyer out uh, here at ringside. And uh, wait a minute, Ollie Anderson has just uh, arrived at ringside. And we've got him now, the superstar. Before the count of three, the Super Destroyer leaving the ring. Some hurried strategy here as the Super Destroyer moves back inside and Tommy Wildfire is up here, six, exploding now between these. He misses with a hard right hand and Tommy Wildfire Rich gets the sleeper hole. Tommy Rich has the sleeper hole on the Super Destroyer. Get them packed! 